Greetings from the Secunderabad Public School, dear students and parents. I am sure each one of you is doing very well by God's grace. We all are aware of the current situation around us. The number of COVID positive cases is surging in many areas and is causing a lot of anxiety to all of us. But life cannot be brought down to a standstill for a long time. We have to move on. They say, we generate fears while we sit, we overcome them by action. So we have decided to upstart with whatever means we have and we are confident that we will be getting better as we move forward. I am happy to announce that we are commencing with the new academic session 2020-21 with online classes from Monday the 8th of June 2020. School without student is lifeless. We are missing the smiling faces of all our dear students. But we cannot put them to risk. So we shall have live online classes for all grades. But we are planning to do so in phases. Students of grade 12 had online classes even in the month of April. We have been sending notes and PowerPoint presentations to the students of other grades in the month of April. Now we plan to have live online classes across the grades. Grades 9, 10 and 12 will have online classes from 8th of June and the students of grades 6, 7 and 8 will be having from the 10th of June. Teachers have put in a lot of effort to ensure that learning outcomes are not compromised due to lockdown. They will be using Microsoft Teams for live online classes and this will happen thrice a week. Prior to each live class, teachers will send some modules with voiceover explanations. The students can go through the content at a convenient time Try to understand and make a point-wise notes on these modules. On the day of live online class, the teacher shall explain the whole content once again and students are expected to keep the notes in front of them and pose their doubts and get them clarified. We have generated individual login IDs for each and every student which will be shared by the class teachers on WhatsApp groups. Both students and teachers will find virtual communication a bit different than face-to-face -face setting. But it is important to compensate the loss of academics and most importantly, keep the students in touch with the subjects. During online classes, teachers will be missing the body language cues and immediate feedback from the students. So it is very important to understand and follow some common rules for good online etiquettes. I request all the parents to provide a dedicated place for the children to attend online classes without disturbance. Also, kindly ensure that the child has the required Wi-Fi bandwidth. If they do not have a spare computer, then parents can share their phone with their children so as to help them connect with the teacher in the online session. It is necessary to keep your child's attention focused on the school work during online sessions. So please ensure that they do not use any other device during that time. Children achieve their best work in a quiet, comfortable and dedicated space that is strictly devoted to learning. This space should be a different setup than where they normally play games or watch television. Routines and schedules are extremely important for children even during online classes. Children will function best if they maintain their routine as close to normal as possible. Setting alarms can be helpful for keeping them on schedule. Around lunchtime, please encourage them to get up, get some fresh air and have good food. Allow them to interact with friends via video 
or on your chats occasionally. This will help boost their morale. But we have to keep in mind that it is important to limit screen time. A schedule will be provided by the teachers on a weekly basis. Please help them prioritize and learn to create daily goals, tasks and deadlines just like adults do when they go to work. Children might feel this time at home as vacation, but it is extremely important to tell them that their learning process cannot be neglected. They will have some tasks, class assignments, chapter and test, etc. at regular intervals using Google Forms. Please ensure that they finish all their assignments in the stipulated time. While it is important to have study time, they must also have some, some fun with family at home. Parents rarely get this much time with their children. So it can be used as an opportunity to bond together with family. We are all going through a tough time. Let us work together and get through this difficult time cheerfully and successfully. I would like to conclude by saying, challenges are what make life interesting. Overcoming them is what makes life meaningful. Don't let what you cannot do interfere with what you can do. Take good care of yourself. My best wishes to all of you. Please stay safe. Thank you.